This is Claire Baby Legs. Do you guys know who this is? Was she on our show? You're for a, a good cop, Baby ago? Legs. <laughs> <laughs> so you might remember Basher. Basher is the guy that was mostly falsely accused of being a pedo by Keemstar for like a year. He did that Most. meltdown video where he was going to kill himself afterwards, but Claire actually stopped him. You guys don't know this drama? Mm, vaguely. I, I, think I remember hearing something about it, but so I it think doesn't. The, the okay. truth behind the basher thing is like he was 18 and he was dating a 15 year old, but he was in a state that had especially restrictive laws. And um, he actually got, I'm, I'm going to call him misdemeanor. I'm not sure what it was, but he had his police thing done on him. And uh, a psychologist looked and said, this guy's not a pedo. They were developmental peers or whatever. He was just in a state where like 18 and 15 was a no go. And, um, Keemstar reported it and got a lot of the facts wrong, changed him to be like 28 years old and her to 13. And um, uh, it nearly drove him to himself. Well, this is his girlfriend. And uh, I don't know what's true. She this is the young, the 14. No, no, this is a later. I'm sorry. This oh. is a, uh, his girlfriend at the time of the drama, not of the police report. Uh, that that okay. girl is no longer in his life. So um, she has just recently become a what's a nice way to say cam whore. a cam model okay all right cam model yeah. um if we yeah. say what it is in different words we can pretend it's not the same thing yes a cam model and um she, like it's it's kind of cam whore have to like get paid by cameras to fuck them or something like like i'm not sure if cam whore is quite accurate either i mean she's a cam model that's true those are some moving goal posts that it's hard to nail down so we'll say model. yeah she's not we'll fucking say anybody for money per se although she did list herself as a sugar baby which is you know someone who's on the uh you know on the other end of a sugar daddy type relationship I, let me see if i can hunt down her like token levels like how much it pays how much you have to pay to get her to do different token stuff. Token levels. What does that mean? So you you I pay. You can't see like that. Unless tokens? You're on their profile. Um, Let's see. I've never okay. used a site like this. Yeah, you change dollars to tokens and then you pay them to do things. Oh my and, God. And so it's just like if you buy gems in some freemium game where they try and fool you into thinking that three coins is enough to look at tits, but it's actually, that's like 30 bucks or something. Yeah, pretty much. And, and the girls set their own like prices for things and their own menu, of course. So like, you know, if you're, cons if you're very conservative, you might be like, Oh, I'll flash my boobs for, you know, $5. But then there might be a girl who's like, Oh, I'll turn on all of these crazy contraptions and like dress up as diva from uh overwatch for 150 credits you know maybe there's <laughs> the, you know and yeah, that's the thing. They, they have to buy an outfit you know you have to make well sure they've got that oh that's the thing well this girl is into that you can see that that's one of her actually she's into cosplay and and i think that's the thing that a lot of guys are into is like seeing like not just a girl get naked but a girl dressed up as laura croft get naked or a girl dressed up as a an anime character get naked or something like that. You know, Misty from Pokemon is like taking off those suspenders and, 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 you know, maybe there's if, more into that. If I were a billionaire, I would go to these sites and I would pay huge sums to make them do things that were not in the least sexual. Like if you go to PetSmart and you buy a snake feeder, a mouse, and then you bring that back and you eat it in front of me, I'll give you 10,000 tokens. <laughs> And they'll be like, that's ridiculous. I just dance around with my clothes off. I'm like, that's fine. You know, if you don't want your 20,000 tokens for eating a rat in front of me, that's now fine. How is this more fucked than going to that uh, that Fiverr website and making those poor Indian No, children? no, I, this, is, I, this is just as fucked. I can't as find that. it. She has a list of stuff that she'll do, right? And um, I'm, I, I don't, like, uh, ever watch live stream girls. Like, I, I've mentioned that on the show before. It seems more like cheating than just... Oh, Regu just so you, regular okay, videos. So, so since you're a bit uninitiated, just to be clear, the way it works is you can go to my free cams, and if she's broadcasting, you can just tune in and watch with like the hundreds or tens of thousands potentially who might also be watching uh, mm -hmm. this live broadcast for free. But then for free, and uh, so here's the the difference though. Like, like, and those people can pitch in money to get this to happen or that to happen. But more often than not, you pitch in money so that you get a private show when it's just you and her. So you pay like a hundred tokens and you and her go into your own private chat she, where, where it's just the two of you and you get to like actually decide what she does so and she does it. Based on what I'm reading on Reddit, <laughs> I don't know if private shows are an That'd option with her. They, they all seem to talk, they might be, but um, she has these goals and apparently her goals are much more expensive than her peers. Like all the other cam girls are mad at her because she's making so much money because she walked into it kind of famous. And uh, um, 
But like, yeah, for like whatever, four thousand dollars, she'll spank her own hiney. And um, uh, I think I saw her give a blowjob to a rubber dildo. Like it was on uh, it was on Reddit. And yeah. um, that's the the naughtiest thing that the I've ROI seen so far. on these investments is uh, is horrible. Yeah. These, these are, like if you're they, paying or, four grand, it's terrible. But if you chip in a buck with four thousand other people, then you might feel like it was a bargain. Oh, everybody froze for me. Yeah. Oh, Kyle's here. I'm I'm here. Okay. I for a moment. I, you guys, are we still recording and all good? And we're... everything is fine. I think my internet yeah. connection stopped for one second. Oh, okay. So um, yeah, this is this is pretty interesting. Is she like open yeah. about this? Is she advertising this on her Twitter and such? I don't know about her Twitter, but I'm she has thousands of people watching. This is a conscious okay, cool. decision she's made. It's not like I'm this Good. is not yeah, fat. It's a smart decision. I bet she's <clears> making <throat> a ton of money. And 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 from what you've said, she's, she's it's pretty pretty vanilla, right? That, like 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 I, I mean Well, I did just go to Streamers Gone Wild and it says Claire Baby Legs Hitachi Come. Now that's just yeah, the there title. You go. I don't know. I mean, but it, she's well, I know what it's gonna have. I know exactly <laughs> what that video is. You might be disappointed. See? You don't know, but uh, I. Well, how, what do you think? It. What would you think if you had a notch level of money? He's always having trouble finding fun stuff to do. Notch, if you're out there, try this one. Go to these really crowded cam girl websites while they're doing their shit, and there's a ton <laughs> of people watching, and bid a huge amount for her to do a Laura Ingalls Wilder cosplay while reading the Bible in a bonnet and just watches people drop off and it'll have to be like a reality show for her of choosing whether to appease this deranged Minecraftian <coughs> billionaire or to keep her current loyal beaten off base because I guarantee those 10,000 guys who are masturbating aren't going to wait for you to get out of your Laura Ingalls Wilder face. They're going to go find <laughs> another girl on there. So, so I, uh, I, get back I, to really me, not tweet me. I watched that. Yeah, she's definitely pretty enough to do this. I watched the... um. Hitachi girls like I just flipped through and saw a couple different points. It looks like she's wearing the lingerie version of a one piece bathing suit and she doesn't take it off and, and she Hitachi's herself uh, over her clothes. And uh, I, I imagine it'd be way sexier if the audio was on. I only see two photos on this whole page. Uh, I'm a, yeah, that's I'm a, because... the streamers going wild there. Yeah. He's on a subreddit where they've uh, <clears throat> saved some of her content. Yeah, they're, um, but on, but they're on that apparently profile, very big fans of her. And she is off to a blazing start as a cam model. But um, t I think, based on having watched her and Basher over the last like two years, three years, I f worry that she's emotionally fragile. And right now... It doesn't seem like this is the behavior of an emotionally fragile person. Really? Because <laughs> do you remember... Um, <laughs> Anthony Cumia brought up that girl and he's like, this I was being an... sarcastic. It oh. totally, it totally is. <clears throat> oh, my totally bad. Is. Yeah. Uh, he's like, look at this anorexic girl on YouTube. She is dying in front of us and everyone's watching it happen. Right. And that girl was yeah. way too thin. Like I, I appreciate a thin girl and that girl was unhealthy. You know, that girl was, I like I'm a little anorexic. <laughs> I don't see this <laughs> at all in the same league as that. I like would not be shocked at all if three years from now, she really had, um, uh, I'm trying to say it nicely. Like, like she had to get her mental health back in condition. I, I think well, that's, I hope not. Like you would think that like, so is this, like, so I mean, obviously so don't is that guy still with her now? Is that the case? I think, but I don't know. Okay. Well, in any case, uh, I, I doesn't look like, I, I think she's she's being she's very, a real businesswoman over there and making th tens of thousands of dollars off the fact that she's very very attractive. And I really like the uh, the one where she's dressed up as Princess Leia. She's she's really pretty. She's got nice eyes. She's got a nice body. She's, she's if, pretty yeah. hot. If she's if she's working in a way that all the other cam girls are like, oh this this bitch fucker. It's probably because she had better ideas and is working a better business model than they were. No, it's and no, it's not. It's no, it, it totally what it is is because she's brought in an established audience. They're mad at her because she's like the oh, what's that? Yeah, yeah. She 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 brought people with her to yeah. this thing. She, you know, she, it, it, millions. It would be and, like it would I bet like, hundred million it, people have seen her on YouTube, like off of Basher's channel. Sure. If Woody went, it, let's say that there was like mm -hmm. some hot shot paramotors who like all shot video of what they do, and they were paramotor YouTubers who were all in the same airport, and all of a sudden Woody joins that crew. All of a sudden, they're all blown out of water, the water, and they fucking hate Woody's guts because they're like, "This guy fucking like cut his teeth on 
Call of Duty and Battlefield, and I've been taken to the sky since 94. You know, I've been shooting since standard depth, oh. and I had a, a big box camera, like, like flying with one hand. You know, they'd be mad. And so, so it's that's just sour grapes, do. basically. It's sour grapes. I think yeah, it's, it's not straight like, up envy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. that's got to be it. Because if she's doing the same thing as them, just way better and way more successful. And way more expensive. Then, of course. Right. These other would, girls yeah, are slapping more. their own hiney for five bucks. Meanwhile, she's yeah. like, it takes a grand to get me to yeah. get out of this chair. I, it's because be she much. knows. I'd like to know how much it is, but there's no way it's, <laughs> it can't be that much. I, I, what I did, I just like randomly clicked through there. She shows her vagina one time. Uh, I, I saw her vagina there. Only one time? Um, well, she, that's what I'm saying. Her, her, it's, it's, it's really kind of vanilla. Like she seemed to like masturbate through clothes and she shows like a peak of this or like, like slaps her butt. Like a lot of these shows are no, really hard. It's got to be way more wild than that. I, it doesn't have to be. Um, a lot of these shows, like not hers, but like on that website, or like really, it's my free cams are really hardcore. You know, it's you know lots. Who is retweeting all of these? Don't you have family that follow your Twitter account or friends or something like this? Yeah, they friends wouldn't matter. But... That's why you're tweeting it so they can all see. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you love your family? Yeah. Hey, you Uncle Billy, look at my, look at this. Yeah, look at this man. I, I really wish I could find it. There was a thread where they were all discussing her business model. They were saying that she needed to lower her prices for weekdays. These people seem to be real experts on how to be a successful cam whore. <laughs> and uh, they're like, man, she's running like weekend prices on a Thursday night. What the hell? You know, the, people are going to keep coming to her streams if the most they get is a hiney spank. You know, for on Thursday nights, you got to make it like possible to achieve these goals and like, it all seemed to make sense to me, but I don't, I don't know these. That makes sense, but also, you couldn't have killed Eddard Stark in episode two. Like, <laughs> you, you need some buildup. She's playing the long game right here, where eventually this will get stale and old, and she'll notice people aren't quite watching because the internet is bananas and I've become banal. And she will be like, okay, well, coming up next week, it's asshole of ash wednesday or whatever the fuck uh day she decides <laughs> to break it out a ass wednesday is what it is and <laughs> then the, she does that she gets a ton more money and then it, that eventually dies down and then she's got you know lesbian uh, lint yeah and then on uh, the 14th she got she gets v-day you know and she and you finally see that or whatever like the next carrot she has dangling in front of you like that's what she's probably doing and that's the smart move because if she just throws it all out there now people aren't gonna they're not going to pay. Yeah, they're they're both ways. Get more money. You if it turns control. out that all she does is like, well, obviously she's not. She's broke out the Tachi and 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 more. But uh, if she didn't ever please her customer base, then like you said, you can't kill Eddard Stark in episode two, but you do got to kill him by episode 10. Otherwise, yes. there's no show. But at the, when you they kill that art, <coughs> the show didn't end. There was a new you know, shrouded mystery to uncover or a new person Ooh. to kill. Are you like, saying you by know, season three, Basher will make his appearance on this? By my... season three, <laughs> we'll be getting full rear. <laughs> I, I don't know yet. I don't, I don't know what she's actually done, but like I, that's, I don't know. I think she, she's playing this really smart. Well, we just gave yeah. her a lot of advertisements. So head on over there and, and pay, yeah. uh, what's her name? Baby legs, uh, Clara baby legs, uh, some money to see her spank herself. She's, she's dude, very attractive. Like, dude, I've watched weeks ago. So many online personalities, like like they get money and then regular jobs are just death to them. And uh, I wonder if that's the path that she's on, right? It, it, like, you know, it, it Scarce said that he was on that path. I think we watched X Jaws take that ride. I don't know where X Jaws is today. Um, All women are on that ride, dude. Like, like every hot woman in the world is on that ride. They're like, I, I don't even know what it'd be like to work a regular job when I have all of this. Like, like I don't she, know why the world is so friendly. Her, her, it, it's easy it's to a see. Good her. Point, man. If, if she's at step B right now, I know what step E and F are. Like, like, like she's gonna lock this thing down. Like, like she's she's leveraging how attractive and personable and yeah. and all of those things that she is. To, and and that's gonna that's gonna she's gonna be able to ride that for the rest of her life. All she's got to do is like marry in the next you know ten to fourteen years, you know, and yeah. everything's okay. It's like in uh, Rick and Morty when uh, the mom says, uh, you know, oh, you know, he can't Morty can't do bad in school. He's not a hot girl. He can't just bail on his life and set up shop at somebody else. Someone else's. And like, you know, Rick that's obviously so laughs because it's funny and it's true <laughs> in a way. Yeah. 
in 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 all the ways that are are true. That girl, and, and this is nothing. I'm not shitting on her because I I admire her and, and and how attractive she is and how she's like comfortable with leveraging Nobody's that and making tens of thousands of dollars. But but if she so wished, I'm sure that she could find some guy out there who'd be like, yeah, move here, fucking set up shop here. You'll have this. You'll have that. You'll have this. You'll have that. And and and, and you won't have to worry about anything. Like like it's oh, it's they, an option that she has. There's not a guy out there. There are mm. millions who would offer that, but most of which would be very creepy and yeah, probably not, not have a lot of money. You're getting offered a lot of mother's basements, a lot of lifetime supply of Mountain Dew Code Red. Hammocks. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> like, 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 a lot of hammocks, a lot of futons, <laughs> a lot of like windows <laughs> with like duct taped trash bags on them. Cardboard right, there's a windows. lot of offers out there, but we gotta <laughs> we gotta get through all of that and find like the you know the 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 the, the guy the millionaire the tech millionaire who's who's established himself and uh, isn't too bad looking, who who wants, I don't know, Princess Leia to come live with him. See, on, on one hand, she's killing it. She's wildly successful. Like Kyle said, she's a, a new businesswoman who's really doing well by herself. On the other, I, I still maintain that her, her mental sanity... I, I feel like this eats away at it, you know? like Would it, you apply like, the same rationale to a man who was doing this? Not as much, you know? not not as. I know double standard, I hear you, but I just feel in the same way that like, when that right, seventeen year old, when that yeah. seventeen year old dude hits the the teacher, not hits the teacher, has sex with the teacher, um, you know, it, it, he probably doesn't walk away totally damaged. He just remembers he slayed pussy in high school, right? Where you you flip that, and maybe the girl does feel like she was taken maybe, advantage of. But I don't. Not think maybe, she but does. not all. I, 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 like certainly, I'm not saying that that I would ever fuck <laughs> someone or anything like that, any of that illegal stuff. Mm -hmm. But but I don't think that. The, I think that a lot of us 14 year old girls who are like willingly fucking their teachers are just, you know, you could be a dirty whore and 14 years old. Like, like, remember, like, like 18 year old uh, dirty whores were for 14 year old dirt, dirt, dirty whores. Like, like, like she didn't, she didn't just like, that's just true. turn that's 18 a, that's and all of a sudden become a whore. Like, like Ar Aria Aspen was on the show. People don't know Aria Aspen was a porn star, like a legit one. She's on Pornhub, et cetera. And um, she described some of the scenes that she did and how it really kind of like, she, this isn't a quote, but hurt her soul. And she's like, I thought that, you know, I just did the scene and I would separate myself from the physical act I did a bit ago. But she's like, I, I wasn't separate from it. You know, I'd finish it. I'd go to my car and I would cry. And uh, it was that's how I remember it anyway. And it's like, oh, what a bummer. Like, I like to think that the girls in these scenes were like, dude, that was really great sex. And, you know, this is my thing and I enjoy it and I don't have heartache over it. But she did. And I think that someday Claire well, will if too. You're watching the kind of porn that she was doing, then yeah. you don't have that in your heart to begin with. You know, like, like you got to keep that in mind too. You've got Clara baby legs over here who is like setting her own rules and her own right. limitations. She's calling and her she's own the shots. one, she's calling all of her own shots. She's showing you her vagina because she made a conscious decision to like pull her panties to the side and show you or whatever. Whereas like, you know, she's signing up for like some hardcore porn. That's, that's, that's partially humiliation and like really rough and, and, and dirty and scary. So like, if you sign up for that, like, like, like when you're signing up at the porn company, if it's called like <coughs> bigfoxaffiliation.com, like maybe they're not going to be nice to your soul there. Maybe if you went to like, I, I, I don't know, like, like, like premium10.com, like, like maybe, the, maybe, maybe they're yeah. not going to Stupid, on you. useless idiots, yeah. sucking cock.net, you know? Yeah. <laughs> oh, this yeah. can't be bad, you know? <laughs> uh, which, which porn site do you work for? Dog fart. That's a real one. Like, like who, who do you work for? Cunt basher. Oh yeah, I work for the one? cunt bashers. Like, no, I made the cunt basher oh. thing up. I'm, I'm just picturing like the Ghostbuster symbol, but it's a pussy, and there it is. It's all these like men who hate women, like fucking them really, really hard and calling them names and stuff. But no, I think Clara Baby Legs is in a situation where I, I don't see how that could hurt her soul. Like she's being dirty and like masturbating for for people who are into it. Like, like that's not hurting her you know soul. You know where it hurts her soul? Of, if people give her a hard time about it, like if if she goes to the grocery store to buy more orange juice, and people are like. I saw your boobs. You know, I never I've got something on you. You know how it works, though. When you, whenever, <laughs> ever, ever you've met a fan of yours, like it's never been that. It's all. It's that never been true. Someone who, it's never that. When people see you in real life, they're like, even if they do have like things about you they don't like, they're just happy to see you anyway. And they're not going to go there to that thing. They're going to be like, hey, even if someone saw Clara and in public and they approached her for some reason, don't do that. You're probably gonna terrify her. She's got a gun. She's waiting. Like if she's smart, like she's just one of these days, someone's gonna kiss so hey baby legs, and I'm just gonna turn around and blah blah blah, blah. <laughs> like no chances. Like, she needs to bring a, a bodyguard around. Uh regular legs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Man big legs. Daddy legs. Yeah, big, big daddy, daddy long legs. Daddy legs. Yeah. I'm baby legs. This is big daddy long legs. <laughs> <laughs> so that's where the show is headed. Yeah, yeah. That's what. See, I'm just giving her an idea. You find mm. you find someone with some big daddy long legs. The twenty five thousand dollar levels. Big daddy long legs gets uh, attention. Sure. <laughs>